Dave here, and something happened to me a couple days ago that reminded me of one of the most common mistakes in marriage. In fact, I'm convinced it's one of the main reasons why people get divorced. So real quick, here's what happened. I was at my house on a Saturday, doorbell rings, I go to the door, and it's a guy from the cable company trying to sell me on his new cable company. And he pulls out his sheet, and he's like, man, I got a deal for you. And I'm like, awesome, I'm up for a deal. And he shows me the price, and it's a great price, and he shows me all the channels I'm going to get, and I'm like, man, this is awesome. And then he says, and you get all this for 12 months. And I'm like, well, that sounds pretty good to me, but let me ask you a question because I'm kind of a long-term relationship kind of guy, even with my cable company. What's going to happen after 12 months? And he said, well, after 12 months, you know, the price goes up and the service goes down and you lose all the premium channels. And I said, so basically, you're giving me everything you've got at the beginning, but then after you've got me and after we've had a relationship for a little while, then you pull back and you give me as little as you possibly can. And he kind of shuffled his feet and lowered his head. He said, well, yeah, technically, but that's how everyone does it. And I thought, wow, what a sad reality we live in if that's how everyone does it. And in some ways, the guy is telling the truth, even in our relationships, even in our marriages, and I believe that this is one of the most common mistakes in marriage, we treat each other like the cable company treats us. We give each other the best we've got, our premium package when we're dating, when we're first married, but then somewhere along the way, we pull back and we start giving as little as we possibly can. And guys, that's just wrong. If you want your relationship to thrive, you've got to give the best you've got every day, all the time, regardless of what your spouse is doing to reciprocate. And if you will consistently give your very best to your relationship, that investment you're making into your spouse and that investment you're making into your marriage will pay off huge returns for both of you in the long, the long run. And real love, let me remind you, means giving your very best to someone even when, they're being unlo- even when they're being unlovable, even when they don't necessarily deserve it, because that's what God has done for us. He loves us even when we're not being lovable. So guys, let me just challenge you. What were the things you were doing in the beginning of your relationship that you stopped doing? Start doing those things again. Don't treat each other like the cable company. Give each other your best each and every day, and your marriage will start to improve immediately. Thanks, you guys, for watching this. For more encouragement, follow our Facebook marriage page or visit me online at DaveWillis.org. God bless.